begin, we wanted to wish you a happy Easter and remind you that Open House is tonight from 5.30 to 7 p.m. Cheer trials started yesterday and going to the 15th, so make sure you guys are going all four days to try out. Now, now let's get into this episode! Hey Colts, it's Sophie, and I'm here to tell you some testing tips for the upcoming state tests. Tip number one is to not overthink. Tip number two is to maintain a positive attitude. Once you start doubting yourself on questions, it can be really hard to focus. Tip number three is to read through the questions carefully and don't speed through the questions. This will make sure that you're really understanding questions before you answer them. Tip number four is to make sure you're getting a good night's sleep before you're actually going to take the test. This will help you focus better when you're taking the test. Final testing tip number five is to take a little mini brain dump. More than likely, your teachers will give you a piece of paper, especially in math class, to answer questions on. And you can take this opportunity to write down some formulas or equations that you might not remember later on in the test. Hope these tips help you with state testing. Bye, Colts! Hey guys, it's Noah Clovis, and I wanted to share some pictures with you from the DC trip. So, uh, here we go. We set off from LAX, we landed down in Boston, and it was freezing. Definitely not California weather. Then we went down to Plymouth and we saw a boulder. We also got to see Fenway Park. Are you an 8th grader? Well, if you are, listen up because we will be talking about the upcoming 8th grade spring ball. Today is the first day you can nominate a king or queen and the last day to nominate someone is Friday, April 15th. If you are interested in nominating someone, you guys can go to the ASB room at lunch. The spring ball takes place on April 21st, 2022 and it will be located in the multi-purpose room. It begins at 6 p.m. and ends at 8 p.m. Tickets are on sale now, but there's a very limited amount left. We wanted to give you guys a heads up that the 8th grade promotion week will be available to purchase online at the ASB store. A $35 donation will be requested. On June 1st, you guys get your in and out lunch. And that same day at 5.30 will be a rodeo dance bash. The dance will end at 8. And on June 2nd, you guys get a carnival field day. This will start at 9.20 and end at 1. You guys also get a hot dog lunch. A permission slip is required. Whew, that was a lot to talk about. Hope you guys got all that information. Almost heaven, West Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Life is older, older than the trees, younger than the mountains, growing like a breeze. Country roads, take me home. Hey Colts, now is the time to choose your next year electives, and this is how.
It's that time of year again. Time for electives. I'm going to show you how to do it. First, go to Aries and choose Classes. Then, choose Course Request Entry. Then, go to the search bar. And you'll be able to choose your two electives. Next. Make sure you request for several backup electives, just in case you don't get the one you originally wanted, because there is no guarantee. Hi, I'm Mrs. Campbell. I teach Multimedia, Computer Science, and Mac News. What is computer science? Computer science is about solving problems and how to solve problems better and faster. Hi, this year we're offering Computer Science 3. At the end of Computer Science 1, we'll be building our own applications. At the end of Computer Science 2, we'll be creating a website. And Computer Science 3 will be building on the knowledge that we've previous learned. One of the main things in Computer Science is Scratch, where you could like make your own code and you can make your own games and you could post them onto the Scratch website so that a bunch of other people could play your games. On Fridays after doing all your work, you can play Gravity Maze. It is a very fun game that helps with critical thinking and problem solving. In computer science, when you're done with all your work, you can play with <laughs> these spheros and you can code them to go around obstacles and program them to change colors whenever you want them to. The reason why you should join computer science for your next um, elective is because it's super fun, it's super chill, and we're all like a family. Miss Campbell is one of my favorite teachers because she gives us the most time and she's really helpful and supportive. Multimedia is a combination of images, video, audio, animation, and text. We do many things in that class, starting with uh, learning applications, some of the Microsoft applications, Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, animation applications, and video production. You will learn camera techniques. You will use our cameras, tripods, microphones, and we just got some new drones. Mm. If you are interested in creating Wait, videos and being color? creative in multiple ways, then multimedia is for you. episode this will be our last time as your anchors so we wanted to give you guys a final farewell so goodbye dorothy McElhaney. you will meet your new anchors next week bye colts you're insecure don't know what for you're turning heads when you walk through the door Oh. Okay, guys, ready? What is that? Oh my, yeah, you're a tiger. Yes, yeah, you are. Oh my goodness, you're a tiger, my. Maddie, do you text your back? I heard it. No, delivered. so. Yeah, but I don't laugh. What is that? Distribute boxes. Among us. Okay. Right quarter? You're not not okay. Okay. I've never noticed the camera kind of like moves the lens in and out when it zooms in and out. You're not okay. Are you okay? Boo boo! Uh, <laughs> hey!